Apprenticeship First is an apprenticeship training agency, or ATA, set up by the College of Haringey, Enfield and North East London and Lewisham College. Just like an employment agency, an employer tells us what sort of apprenticeship they are offering and what kind of recruit they are after, and we at Apprenticeship First will provide a matching service. The service also works for potential apprentices who give us their details and we look for suitable apprenticeships. It's an ingenious scheme which benefits employers and apprentices. In this video you'll hear some of their stories. Apprenticeships is where somebody is earning while they're learning, basically. They're working for four days a week, they come to college one day a week and they earn a qualification at the end of it, which probably consists of an MVQ, a technical certificate, key skills and an apprenticeship certificate on top of that. With the apprenticeship schemes itself, uh, obviously the guys have to show uh, their ability as far as the practical elements are concerned, which a lot of companies, they want their guys to get in and uh, start and start on undertaking the job as quickly as possible. So there, there is a great emphasis on the practical element, but then that has to be backed up by what we term then as the written element, the theoretical side. So I suppose uh, you're looking at uh, probably a 60, uh, 40 percent ratio in relation to 60 percent practical, 40 percent uh, written. Well, I'm currently employed by Apprenticeship First. It's just everything's run pretty well. There's no problems. Everything's going good so far. At Apprenticeship First, we match apprentices to apprenticeships from all areas of the industry. That includes creative and media, business and administration, care and health, ICT and computing, hair and beauty, sports and fitness, science and a wide range of manual trades. Whatever sector of the workforce you are interested in, get in touch with Apprenticeship First. These guys are recruited generally through uh, apprenticeship websites. Uh, my company also has uh, fingers in a number of uh, pies, so to speak, to uh, send out adverts uh, in newspapers and so on and so forth. Guys then sort of come along to some of the interviews and we go through a, a selection and interview process and subsequently guys are put onto these MVQ programmes. So I can't really see myself working in an office. I want to do something practical. And like, I've, I've always lived like, next to a railway so I've been fascinated by like, all that. I've like, aspired to work on that. Because it's more work based. I, I'm not into a lot of homework, a lot of coursework. It's not for me. It's work-based and at the end of it you get a job, which sounds good to me. Working out here, just being out here doing something instead of being stuck in the classroom all the time. Training, as far as many companies is concerned, in the initial stages is quite expensive. Um, obviously with the uh, in, uh, financial environments as, as we've got these days, um, with the expense of initial training, the companies tend to want to get their guys on the spot, doing what they need to do as quickly as possible. And doing the apprenticeship schemes obviously enables that. The guys are already prepped uh, so that they can literally start with a company and give full-time uh, employment uh, and jobs, etc., to the company and obviously get the job done a lot quicker and, in theory, a lot cheaper because there's no train, initial training actually involved. Well, I weren't doing nothing. Um, I left school kind of early. Then I thought about, I didn't know what I wanted to do. I didn't, like, I weren't really interested in nothing. Before I tried, tried going to school, tried college, but it didn't really work out. So before this started, I wasn't actually doing too much. But then it came up, connections rang me up about a good apprenticeship. I saw railway engineering. I saw the money was good then. Like I wanted to do something practical instead of just sitting down. 
Well, I've, I've advised quite a few people about this apprenticeship because obviously I like it a lot and if you're not doing anything, then you might as well get involved. That allows you to get a job. It gives you everything you need. I just told them what I do, how it's going. I told them how good it is. And I told them that I wouldn't do anything before. And then this come along, it's just helped me out a lot. Gain more than just uh, qualifications to work on the railway. Gain key skills, bit training, and team working skills, working out here. Probably when was in the pack schools, working on the rail, like lifting and shoveling and all that. It's so, like good work as well. Like, really pack school. It's the people you meet, the stuff you learn, and the fun you have.